Where are you uh, located at? Well, I'm in Siloam, North Carolina, Surrey County. I'm 30 miles northwest of Winston-Salem and about 20 miles south of Mount Airy. Well, North Carolina. Right. Uh, this pescue and all, uh, looks awful good for uh, pescue hay. Uh, how many years you been growing pescue? Probably 20, 22. You, are you pleased with this? I mean, yeah, I'm pleased where we put this soap on. It looks good. You didn't use soap last year. What? What's the difference? Well, there's a big difference here. In other words, it. Uh, a whole lot taller and more undergrowth. Yeah, you know? more undergrowth. It's taller. You know, I mean, it's just thick. It looks good and good and thick. Oh, so you, you're well pleased with the all the extra you done this time with soap? Yeah, yeah. And I'm well pleased. Done it twice? Yes. Yeah, it looks good to me, I tell you. I've been raising hay and stuff, and I tell you, it looks awful good. Mm -hmm. How old is the seed? Uh, how, did you reseed this uh, fescue? This uh, originally was in alfalfa 20 years ago, and then it went into orchard grass. And, and if you don't stay on orchard grass, uh, the fescue is bad to take it over. So it's just more or less kind of took it over to the fescue. I'll, I'm going to eventually, this is on a rented farm, put it back in orchard grass. Well, orchard grass is a lot higher in protein. Yeah, it's higher in protein, and I just, uh, I like good fescue, but I like the orchard grass, too. It's a little bit better. Uh, you know. This looks like some good. It is. I mean, I don't have no complaints. I like it. Uh, yeah. But if you wanted to sell any hay, the horse people, they like the orchard grass better. Yeah. Yeah, if I'm feeding cattle, I'd rather feed orchard grass. Yeah. But if you mow this right now, or just as our problem with having a lot of rain, of course, last two years we didn't have enough. Right. Just as quick as we can get in here, I mean, it'll make good hay. It'll right. be pretty hay. And they'll yeah. eat it good. What I like is that undergrowth and all oh, that. Oh, yeah. Like, yeah. Under the heads and all this stem, I mean, they'll eat that, but that's what counts is what's down there. Yeah. If you don't have no grass under there, you ain't got nothing. Right. Looks awful good. Well, uh, thanks a lot, guys, and uh, we'll uh, come back next year and see uh, how much this field improves. Are you going to switch this to orchard grass next year or no, what? No, I need to work on the pH a little bit. Orchard grass takes a little more management and, and getting the pH. Like I say, this farm has kind of been mismanaged for a few years. I just took it over last year, so I, uh, it's really come a long way since last year. And it'll probably be a couple of years before I go all orchard grass. Well, thanks awful lot, guys. You're